So what is a Boolean in Project Spark? This is a question we get all the time, and uh, Boolean is a very simple type of variable that just looks for true false statements, and then it can use that to have new things happen in your game. So what do I mean by that? Let's quickly go through a scenario. We have our main character here, we have our enemy here, we have a logic cube that we're going to use in just a tiny bit, and uh, I want to uh, happen here. We have this uh, enemy that's going to come try and hit me, and when I defeat him, I want a message to appear at the bottom of the screen that says, you are winner. So we can do that with a Boolean. Let's go ahead and jump into the logic cube right here. And let's have a look for stuff to happen. So we're going to look for win. Let's go to the objects in world picker and let's uh, get a picker of this goblin right here. So win goblin bruiser. Uh, we're going to look for combat uh, is dead. And we're also going to put a started to right here because we only want to look for this uh, one time for one frame. It's always good to clamp stuff down. Uh, but when started to goblin bruiser is dead, then do, we're going to go to values, the values folder, and this is where you find booleans. We're going to create a new boolean variable, and we are going to call this winner. So do winner equals, we go to values again, boolean again, that's where, that's where you're going to find true. So a boolean can be toggled either true or false. And when it's true, you can have something in your game happen. When it's false, it can have something in your game happen. This is a great way to basically log when things happen in your game. So it's great for when a quest has been complete, when a boss has been defeated, when uh, you've, you've grown to a certain level, when you can unlock an ability. Uh, Booleans are kind of the, the basis for a lot of that. But here we're just simply displaying text when you defeat this enemy. So we're going to have on the next line, win winner. Now you can do either win winner or win winner is equal to uh, true. They both mean the same thing. Just doing uh, win winner is a um, quicker way of just uh, saying that when this Boolean is equal to true, then we're going to have something happen. Now I have it as a child line under here. I personally like to have these as child lines. Of course you don't have to. Uh, a child line basically inherits anything from its uh, parent line on the win side. So uh, this indented line is a child line. That's its parent line. So this on the win side is inherited right here. Uh, but we could also just condense it down to one thing. Uh, so then we have win uh, winner do uh, display. And we're going to bring some text here. You is winner. We're going to uh, put this at screen location bottom center. And let's go ahead and make this color uh, blue. And let's also make it extra large font. So we'll go jump into test mode. And we're going to punch this goblin. And now you see you as winner at the bottom. So just using a quick, simple Boolean, we were able to track when something in the game happens. Here, it's when this goblin bruiser is dead. And uh, something happens once uh, this Boolean becomes true. And here, it's just this message that says you as winner starts displaying at the bottom of the screen. So that's a quick way to show you what booleans do and uh, how you can kind of use them to trigger in-game events from happening. Project Spark is where players create and creators play. What better way to be inspired than to see what's possible? This will surely spark your imagination. Now, how do we begin?